class to get to the gym, but red lights, traffic everywhere. Probably make a good three hour trip to get to the gym today. And I won't pain you guys by having you guys watch me drive to the gym for these three hours. Probably less, maybe. So, yeah, we're doing shoulders today. Before we go any further, though, subscribe and like the video now, of course, before we get started. And once this crucial, painful, and tedious ride has ended, we can get to the gym and I can show you some shoulder workouts to strengthen those shoulders. So it looks like you got pads on your shoulders when you really just got nice looking muscles. Unbelievable. Finally, I'm actually pooped, but gotta hit this gym. Here with the brother. Going to the gym with him. And the uh, soccer mom minivan. Uh, we're gonna be there in a second. And I'll show you some shoulder workouts and trap workouts. The shoulders and traps are kind of the same thing. Let's get in and let's get started. We have arrived at Planet Fit. I'm gonna lock this door up. My one and only true love. And it is prime time. Well, at the end of prime time, we all know the gym prime time is between 5 and 7. That is the busiest time for the gym of the day. People walking in from all over. Good old Planet Fitness. I'm gonna hop in here, get some work done. Show you some tr shoulders. I'm gonna do some abs first because, oops. Because, my brother's gonna go for a run. Come on. No problem. So we'll do some abs first and then I'll show you the shoulder workout afterwards. Gym is packed as usual. Tons of TVs. I love that they have those TVs here, actually. I don't need those. The TVs for running on the treadmill. I don't like it and I do. I sometimes get distracted by watching the TV. Sometimes get distracted by watching the TV. So I don't always like having the TV, but I guess when doing cardio, it helps to distract from the pain. Everything else works out better. Look at these abs together. I hit it hard. Number one. So I'm gonna go silent, do some uh, abs, and then I'll get back to you doing shoulders in a little bit. Alright, so the first one we're going to do is regular shoulders to hit the sides and the front. Brother's turn. So, this exercise is for the shoulders up here, the fronts, and the sides. Um, just like right here, front and the sides to hit it. It's a good exercise, front and to the side, so you gotta hit all the shoulder because there's a lot of different muscles in there. So that's one of the major ones I do. We set to 10, obviously. Um, so I'm working on my brother, just the same like as I do. So that's one of the first ones I do. Um, after this, I'll show you the next one we do. The, the back of the shoulder. I'll show you that right after this. First, let me hit this first, and we'll get right to it. Shoulders. 
straight out to the sides. This is going to work right here, the back part of the muscle of the shoulder. Straight out, elbows close. I work the outside of the shoulders. I'll show you mine on the side. Keep it That's the uh, back of the shoulder and muscle that I was talking to you about. You need to hit that one. That one hurts kind of hard. You make sure your elbows are in the whole time. Uh, so, yeah, that's just the back part of the muscle of the shoulder. And then make it a nice full round shoulder muscle on top of your shoulders. Uh, and then after this, I'll show you the uh, trap workout we do. Increase the traps because they're part of the shoulders as well. It's pretty simple. I'm sure that in a little bit, but I'm gonna hit the rest of these real quick. It's like two, two, three, three, two, three. I'll show you here. Get me? I wanna hold it at the top. It's kinda of like flex that muscle. Why you look like that? So you want to just kind of hold it at the top, and flex that muscle, one, two, three, two, two, three. And like it's an extra pump in, so just going straight up and straight down. You don't want to really rest in between with the traps. Uh, this is just, I just added them in shoulders. I don't do a whole bunch. I do five sets of, th of 10 with this stuff, um, because it's really only one way to work. I'm just basically doing that motion. So I just do one, two, three, two, three to uh, stretch the muscle, get it better intense, work out on it. Um, so me and my brother are going to hit this. That's how you get that trap in the shoulder. If you just go up and down, it'll get strengthened, but it won't really make that definition. But we go one, two, three, two, two, three, like that, and just like basically hold it up there, which <laughs> looks like I'm getting easier. Um, that's what gets the definition. Um, so that's one of the main things you want to do. Press, this is for the top of the shoulder, the last part. Yeah. And you want to use these top part. Not the sides, which hands to be straight. Come down to about 90 degree angle, maybe a little lower. And the keys are going slow, not too fast, but not too slow. Just at a good pace. So that's like the basic key. You want to go not too fast, not too slow, but good enough that it burns. And get away. You'll see me do it in a quick second. Come get me. This is the last one. This is the last one. Always puts it at the bottom. <laughs> so, so not too fast, not too slow, to the even pace, a nice burn down to about 90 degree angle and back up. And uh, that's uh, what we basically do for our shoulder days. So, uh, in case you didn't know what to do, if you're starting out and you wanted to know what to do for shoulders, this is a big case, the big thing you can do for your shoulders, get your shoulders stronger, everything better. Um, yes, yeah, it's a big thing to get your shoulders stronger. If you're starting off, maybe you need to switch your workouts up. If you go slow and go up, weights at a small amount. So if you increase by two and a half or five pounds if your gym has it, instead of 10 and 20 pounds, you'll be able to increase over a long period of time. Also going slower gets better definition and gets you stronger faster. Um, so that's what we're going to do it. That's it for us for today. Um, I'm going to go finish my workout. I'll talk to you a little bit more uh, when we leave the gym. Beautiful gym. Gym, I came over. Look at this community. They cut our grass. Well, not our grass, but I guess it's community. Nice and neat. There goes my cat again. She, he loves being out here in the dirt in the squander. Sorry about that. I'm 17. Lena's a sophomore, I realize. Um, but my phone died because I ran a battery, but yeah, they cut on one and I uh, was it for today, but 
Yeah, so that was how you do shoulder workouts. I'm tired. About to chow down on some spaghetti and some chicken. I'll tell you this for sure. If this hand or any other hand for that matter touches my daughter in a way I don't like, <laughs> I hate to see something happen to your lifeline. So, I'm sorry, watching the movie called Ouija right now. But, uh, yeah, so, those are good shoulder workouts. Slow is key. Uh, you want to take your time with a lot of it. Uh, so, everything, uh, so the muscle gets a bigger burn in less time, uh, more definition. Uh, so, not too slow, but not too fast. Uh, but right before you finish watching, go down there, subscribe to my channel, tell your friends about it. Tell me what you think about it, and we'll see you next time. See you later.